Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this interesting logical reasoning problem. So we need to find 4 plus 1 which will be equal to. We have a lot of rows. We have 1 plus 4 equal to 5, 2 plus 3 equal to 8, 3 plus 2 equal to 9 and we need to find the last one. On the right hand side we have a lot of options 5, 8, 4 and 1. So right now think about the pattern between all of these, all of these rows, all of this expression and write your answer in a comment right now and after 20 seconds we will, we will check, we will see your answer it will be correct or not and we will see how many answers will be correct so put one and write your answer in in the comments so let's try to find the pattern between all of these all of these numbers so take a look we have 1 plus 4 equal to 5 which is correct 2 plus 3 equal to 8 this is not correct so as for me i don't see any obvious pattern between all of these all of these numbers 3 plus 2 equal to 9 this is not correct as well what the pattern between all of these numbers so i see one one thing between one obvious thing between all of these all of these rows let's use not addition but multiplication let's see how what we will have if we multiply 1 times 4 we will have we will have 4 so this row we are talking about 4 if we multiply this take a look if we multiply 2 times 3 we will have 6 so let's see we will have right here 6 if we multiply first two digits 3 times 2 we will have 6 as well so as a result in the third row we will have 6 and in the last row we will have 4 times 1 we will have we will have 4 so not obvious thing but we have a lot of a lot of answer right here and what are we going to do next take a look right here we have numbers 5 8 9 and right here we have the same numbers but we need to do something with it take a look we need right here we have 5 i write this number right here we have 5 right here we have 8 right here we have 9 and we need to find the last one this is right here what we need to do with this 4 to get 5 of course we need to add to add 1 to these numbers what we need to add to do with this 8 to get what we need to do to get with the 6 to get 8 we need to add 2 as you can see so with this one 6 plus 3 will be 9 so as you can see 6 plus 3 will be 9 so as you can see the pattern between all of these rows multiplying first two digits right here right here and right here and as you can see we have a natural order Firstly, add 1, add 2, add 3, and of course, in the last case, we need to add 4, because this is the pattern between all of these numbers. And 4 plus 4 will be our last number, we are talking about 8. So our, our answer will be, will be 8. What do you think about it? I, I, I solve it and I choose option B. What do you think about it? Maybe you have another option. It will be really interesting to read it. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos.